I am in Panorama Towers in Unit 2601. This is an 01 floor plan, which means it's a one bedroom with a den over a thousand square feet and has the best view in Panorama Towers for any one bedroom. Let's get into the unit and I'll tell you exactly what it is. Okay, I got the kitchen behind me, but of course I'm gonna start in the front door. This unit is listed for $535,000 and that is actually a very good price for being so high up in the building. So here we are, if you walk into your unit, we're gonna be looking to the left and you have this large den area, which others have turned into a, um, a bedroom or an office with a Murphy bed situation. Um, a lot of people have taken these doors or this opening and closed it off with a uh, sliding door or a curtain or something, whatever works best for them, right? So, and I wanna kind of walk through here just so you can kind of see what we're looking at. And this is a herringbone pattern throughout the unit. And this is actual tile. So it's not a laminate floor in this area. It is a real tile floor. And then let's get over here. Straight across from the den is your half bath. So you have your sink, your water, or your toilet, and here. And then this is for um, some storage and for your mechanical area as well. And I just wanna kind of pan through here so you can see a little bit of everything of how, it, how the layout is. Here we go, perfect. And again, this is 535,000. It's available uh, today. We are in January of 2024. And I wanna show you here the kitchen. We're gonna walk through and then we'll end up with the view and uh, the master bedroom. Panorama Towers does have gas. So if you are a cooker, then that is highly uh, irregular for high rise condos here in Las Vegas to actually have gas. It's usually just a uh, electric situation. <laughs> you do have a large bar here. I do like this. So you don't have to have a table in this area. You could fit easily four people. Potentially, I think I've, I've seen them push it up to six, but that gets a little bit tight for the chairs. Uh, so you can do definitely do four people in this unit. And again, we're probably about a little over a thousand square feet. And uh, Mashid, she's a great real estate agent here in Las Vegas. This is actually her listing and uh, she allowed me to come in and actually take a video of it. I've showed this a number of times and I just wanted to get you guys to be able to put eyes on it too because I think it's such a value. So here we are looking in the living room and again you have your kitchen that flows right into the living room with your uh, tile floor with the herringbone pattern and then what I'm most excited about is this bedroom because in this bedroom you have uh, views, views, views. And I'm just gonna just walk right in so you can see the view. Look at this thing. Look at this view. I mean, you get this from the living room, but in your bedroom, my gosh. And well, the fun thing is, if you put your bed, I'm on, my back is against a wall right now. You'd be looking out your bedroom, uh, looking off your bed, waking up in the morning and seeing this. It's all glass all the way in the corner here, your balcony's glass, and you can see a little bit of everything. You have the airport over here, Mandalay Bay, and when you're on the balcony, you actually see the Raiders Stadium. So that's pretty cool, and we'll get to it in just a second. I wanna run through here so you can at least see. And I'll pan through the bedroom so you can see the bedroom area. Here we are. Perfect. And then this is a laminate floor that's in this room. It's separate from the herringbone tile floor over in the living room area and throughout the rest of the unit. Here is your closet area with your sliding panels here. And Panorama, it just has a good design to it. I love the floor plan, I love the layout. For being a one bedroom den setup, this is pretty good. You do have a double vanity and a shower that is separate from the, uh, the tub here right behind me actually. So I'm just gonna pan through here so you can take a look at this. And then the tub area, which is actually huge, pretty spacious, and you have a lot of room for decorations and being designed. If you can design a unit, or if you wanna have a professional designer come in, this is something that's gonna be a real good palette for them to be able to do their job and make it look really nice. Here we go. Now let's get out onto that balcony and we'll take a look at what that is right over here. So going through, and you know what? I just, I just wanna pan through this one more time just because look at this floor plan. 
It's set up so well. You're coming in through your front door, you have your den area off to the side, and then all the guests come right into here and see this strip view right off the bat. Here we are. So I'm on the balcony right now in this unit, 2601. We are a little over halfway up the tower, actually a little bit more potentially, because there's only 33 floors in this tower. And if you look over all the way, right through here, whoop, that's where the Raiders play. That's the Allegiant Stadium, uh, home of the Raiders, Las Vegas Raiders. And then if we go look right over here, this curved area, that is the Golden Knights, for the, the home of the Golden Knights. So they play there in that uh, T-Mobile arena right over here. We got New York, New York. We have MGM, uh, Park MGM over here. The, of course, the Aria right over here as well. Uh, Vidara and all of the classic stuff. Bellagio is over here. Caesars Palace, where Caesars actually lives. <laughs> and the uh, Trump all the way down. And then this right here, the freeway is the 15 freeway. This is the main vein that cuts right through Las Vegas from California going to Salt Lake City. California is gonna be off this way. And then California, and then uh, Utah is gonna be straight up ahead if that's where you're looking for. Now, valet in uh, Panorama, you do have one assigned parking spot and then the rooftop of each parking garage is all valet. There are electric car chargers as well. And you do have a, uh, you actually do have a uh, uh, car service with this tower. So you do have Escalades, and then I'm just gonna pan over this, uh, this area here so you can take a look at how large the balcony is. You do have Escalades car service that comes with your HOA dues, and um, it will take you within three miles of the tower and uh, pick you up and drop you off from the airport. So if you're coming into town, you can have your car come and get you. You can always order an Uber, but it's just nice that this is included in your HOA dues already. Here we go. And I'm just gonna do a quick run through one more time of this unit. Again, it's listed at $535,000 and we are over a thousand square feet, a one bedroom den area. And you do have a uh, one bath, one and a half bath. Oh, you know what? And I did not show you the washer and dryer area. So we have the washer and dryer in here, stackable units. And then you know what? If we can, let's get into this extra storage uh, and the mechanical closet so you can take a look at what's inside in here. So you do have this large area right in here for extra storage. And then peeking around to the right is your mechanicals. There we go. Perfect. I like to get these details in for you because not a lot of times that I'm able to actually see it unless you come to the properties and take a look for yourself. Now, I hope this helped you take a look at what Panorama Towers is and this 01 floor plan. Any unit that has a 01 at the end of it in Panorama Towers is going to be this exact same floor plan. It may be flip-flopped a little bit, but that's the only difference. Um, again, if you have any questions about real estate in Las Vegas, don't hesitate to call or text me. We do high-rise condos, properties off the strip, we do commercial properties, literally everything within the realm of real estate in Las Vegas is what I'd love to help you out with. All right, have a good one, guys. We'll talk to you soon.